Don't you think that there are too many accidents out there? Well, I do. And sadly, we are guilty of most of them. Don't get me wrong, we are not evil creatures. We are just making mistakes. But what if there is another way of driving? A way that can cut the rate of accidents? How about self-driving cars? Can we trust them? Self-driving cars see through the eyes of cameras. And using this data, their artificial brain is able to find drivable areas by complex tracking algorithms. Oh wait, they can't just rely on data captured by cameras. More specifically, snow, too bright reflections, too dark areas. They all can ruin what's captured by camera. And inaccurate data equals faulty drivers. LiDAR, light detection and ranging, is a highly sophisticated sensor that provides detailed data from every scene in all weather and lighting conditions. But why don't we use them in our self-driving cars right now? The answer to that question is one, their data is harder to interpret. From one single target, their output is something like this, hundreds of disconnected points. And two, it takes hours to process all this data individually inside the tracking algorithms. And that's where I come into play. Hello everyone, my name is Mehnoush, and my study allows us to use this LiDAR data to define a clear picture of the road for self-driving cars. Well, how do you interpret this LiDAR data? Most probably, you are gonna connect them together and say, well, it's a rectangle, it can be a car. That's exactly what I'm trying to do, to mathematically estimate the best shape that fits my data and give them meaning. Later, by collecting and processing more data, I'm able to improve my initial estimation of the shape, all of them in real time. By this technique, I'm able to detect and track cars, pedestrians, bicyclists, while my self-driving cars are moving in poor lighting and weather conditions. So by eliminating human errors, we are cutting the rate of accidents as well as, hopefully, our feeling of guilt. Thank you.